Hi, Paul Stacy here, um, the executive director of the Open Education Consortium. I'm on my rooftop deck in Vancouver, Canada. As you can see behind me, there's the city skyline. It's a series of updates I thought I'd do about some of the exciting work we're doing at the Open Education Consortium with a with a expressed invitation for you to join us and participate. Um, back in April in Delft, Netherlands, during our Open Education Global 18 conference, people pitched all kinds of ideas to me about things that they thought the Open Education Consortia should engage in. And out of all those ideas, three were picked and we put them out uh, to see what expressions of interest um, there might be in terms of participation. The three pilots are first a fellowship exchange which would involve our members who have expertise in open education in particular areas mentoring and doing a knowledge exchange for other members who seek to acquire that expertise. How might that work? Who'd be, who'd be interested? Who has something to offer? Who's interested in taking something that pilot project is all about that, and um, we have some great expressions of interest in, in helping make that happen. Another pilot project um, has to do with what is being called the Open Anatomical Atlas. Um, this is in recognition of the need to have images and illustrations related to anatomy, uh, course and, and area of uh, subject matter that is taught everywhere around the world and is a universal kind of need the human body is kind of the same everywhere in the world and so um, this has actually generated the largest expression of interest is uh, for people who teach anatomy and physiology around the world can we coordinate and collectively create a body of images and works that help teach anatomy uh, and have those images and illustrations and videos and other materials be openly licensed and available for free to everyone the third uh, pilot project is one about open education resources translation. Um, a lot of open education resources now exist, but they're primarily in English. So this particular pilot project is seeking interest from people around the world who would like to engage in translation of existing open education resources into another language and involves identifying what resources are a priority for translation and what languages should they be translated into. Did a little webinar kicking all that off this week. We've created a set of Google Doc uh, summary documents that describe the expressions of interest so far and map out a bit of a planning in terms of the questions that should be addressed. Uh, we've also created some Slack channels inside our tech Slack technology that the Open Education Consortia uses and created a channel for each of those pilot projects for people who are interested to, to meet and discuss and dialogue about how to work collaboratively on these initiatives. We're excited about these initiatives because they have a global relevance and involve people who are engaged in open education initiatives around the world collaborating together and coordinating their work for, uh, for communal and collective interest. Hope you'll join in. There's some uh, invitations for you on the website and please uh, participate.